is about me. I ran every test I could imagine, searched the Fade, yet found nothing. Cassandra suspected duplicity. She threatened to have me executed as an apostate if I didn't produce results. Cassandra's like that with everyone. <laughs> yes. You were never going to wake up? How could you? The mortals sent physically through the Fade. I was frustrated, frightened. The spirits I might have consulted had been driven away by the Breach. Although I wished to help, I had no faith in Cassandra, or she in me. I was ready to flee. If you'd run, Cassandra would have been certain of your guilt. She'd have hunted you down. You are likely right. I told myself, one more attempt to seal the rifts. I tried and failed. No ordinary magic would affect them. I watched the rifts expand and grow, resigned myself to flee, and then... It seems you hold the key to our salvation. You had sealed it with a gesture. And right then, I felt the whole world change. You didn't say it that way, I don't think. You just said it. Is that how you remember it? That is what I mean about perception shaping our existence. But that's only true in the Fade. Where do you think we were? This isn't real. That's a matter of debate. Probably best discussed after you... Wake up. How are the rescue efforts? Have they found anyone alive? Excavation is slow, as you can imagine. Inquisitor.
sleep well? I had some odd dreams. Very odd dreams. With very odd people in them, for that matter. I will take that as a compliment, given that you include yourself. Remember, you came looking for me. I had no idea that the Anchor would allow you to dream with such focus. It is truly remarkable, but I am reasonably certain we are awake now. And if you wish to discuss anything, I would enjoy talking. We'll talk later. Goodbye. Alexius researching magic for you. Research is always what made him happiest. Perhaps I'll even go talk to him eventually. One word of advice. If he suggests altering time as a way to solve all your problems, give it a pass. It occurs to me that I barely know anything about you. I am the scion of House Parvus, a product of generations of careful breeding and the repository of its hopes and dreams. Naturally, I despised it all. The lies, the scheming, the illusions of supremacy. That's Tevinter in a nutshell, isn't it? Needless to say, my family was not happy with my choices. I'm getting the impression that you don't care much for your homeland. On the contrary. I care for my homeland a great deal. There's so much potential. Sadly, we squander it. We refuse to acknowledge how far we've fallen because pretending is easier. We pretend the Kunari can be beaten. We pretend that we're superior to everyone, even our own people. Not everyone feels that way. I don't. Sadly, we're the minority. It just seems... So much of what you say about the Imperium is entirely negative. It might sound that way. For all our faults, my people have many virtues. We are laden with history and culture. Tevinter is where Thedas truly began, remember? We treasure our past and preserve it. You can walk down a side street and find nothing built during the modern ages. And despite appearances, we care deeply about everything. We have no reserve, not in war and not in love. If I truly believed my homeland was beyond all hope, I wouldn't miss it so much. Why remain with the Inquisition? Why not go back to Tevinter? <laughs> I'm not exactly welcome back home. Not that it matters, I'm quite accustomed to being a pariah. It adds to my charm. I can do more for Tevinter here. If the Venatori succeed, it'll set my homeland back a thousand years. I'm sure some Magisters would disagree, but that's why we kill them. I think I've heard enough. That's too bad. I never tire of talking about myself. I should go. Naturally. Inquisitor. What is your evaluation of how we're doing? Adequate. Based on the partial improvements to Skyhold. As you were? Yes, Inquisitor. <laughs> your open support for the mages likely earned you enemies. Our agents will monitor the situation. If the most opposed can be identified, we may still turn this to our advantage. People can hate me if they wish. That gets us nowhere. The Inquisition is young. We need to build our support. Regardless, I applaud you for the courage to stand up for the mages. Let's talk about you. Me? 
What did you do before you worked for the Divine? I trained to be a spy from a young age. Learned from the best. For a while, I was wildly happy. I loved the thrill of that life, the danger. But nothing lasts forever. I went into hiding, and when I emerged, the Divine called on me. She presented me with my own network of spies, and said I was the only one she could trust. Bards tell tales. I bet you tell some good ones. There are plenty of tales in the library. Perhaps you should look for them there. I should leave you to your work. We can always talk later. Close all you like. I have this one. Are you sassing me, Commander? I didn't know you had it in you. Why do I even... Inquisitor. Leaving, are you? Does this mean I win? Please, don't stop on my account. All right. Your move. You need to come to terms with my inevitable victory. You'll feel much better. Really? Because I just won, and <laughs> I feel fine. Don't get smug. There will be no living with you. I should return to my duties as well. Unless you would care for a game. Prepare the board, Commander. As a child, I played this with my sister. She would get this stuck-up grin whenever she won, <laughs> which was all the time. My brother and I practiced together for weeks. Oh, the look on her face the day I finally won. And between serving the Templars and the Inquisition, I haven't seen them in years. I wonder if she still plays. You have siblings. Two sisters and a brother. Where are they now? They moved to South Reach after the Blight. I do not write to them as often as I should. Ah, oh, it's my turn. All right, let's see what you've got. This may be the longest we've gone without discussing the Inquisition, or related matters. To be honest, I appreciate the distraction. We should spend more time together. I would like that. Me too. You said that. We should finish our game, right? My turn? I believe this one is yours. Well played. We shall have to try again sometime. 